And now you have $50, and we give our panel the first clue. By the way, that's my natural hair. I am a blonde. This is a wig that I'm wearing <laughs> here. Uh, we'll start our questioning. Uh, you can see while I'm acting, you're home doing nothing. Uh, Edie Adams. <laughs> Tell me, this took place recently? Yes. Uh, uh, did it take place near here? No. No? Uh, how recently? Within the last month? Yes. Had something to do with a fire? Did you save somebody from fire? No. Did, did it have any... It had, you say it had nothing to do with, with the fire. Uh, are you, you're married? Yes. And uh, you're uh, very statuesque and beautiful. Are you in show business? No. Your, your compliments aren't going to get any extra answers I out of her. Just stick to the <laughs> yes or no stuff, okay? Uh, all right. All right, yeah. Was, uh, what you did, was it a, a big news story? Yes. And it had to do with, with a heroic act that someone performed? No. It, what? Uh, was it in the, the field of politics? Yes. Politics, yes. Yeah. All right, uh, the Jim Backus, now we go to Cesar Romero. Uh, do you come from Michigan? Yes. A town called Livonia? I could punch him right oh. in your name. Oh. Your name, Mrs. Mary Worm? Oh, gee. No. Yes, it's <laughs> close enough. I can't. Uh, yes. Worry Worm or something. You're, <laughs> you're in charge of. You're in charge of 47. 47 policemen and 55 firemen. Oh. Yes. You're, Caesar, you're oh. wonderful. He's tonight. amazing. Very well she, uh, This is Miss <laughs> Laurie. I Mary think it's just Joel. a few weeks ago appointed by the mayor of Livonia, Michigan, and she is now the head of police, and will be in November, <laughs> and the police and fire departments in that city. Caesar, you're remarkable. Yeah, yeah. 